Hey everyone, welcome back to Minutes. Today we're diving into a coming-of-age story with a twist. Boy, originally titled Dreng. Released in 2011, this Danish film explores the forbidden desires and unexpected consequences that can arise when youthful innocence collides with adult experience. Meet Christian, a fresh-faced high school graduate with his whole life ahead of him. Summer stretches before him, a time of freedom and possibility. He lands a summer job, eager to earn some cash and experience the world outside the classroom. But little does he know, a chance encounter will turn his summer upside down. Enter Santa, a captivating single mother brimming with a sensuality that Christian, on the cusp of adulthood, finds utterly intoxicating. She's everything he isn't expecting, confident, experienced, and a world older than him. Sana sees a spark in Christian, a youthful energy she craves. Their attraction is undeniable, and soon a forbidden romance blossoms. This isn't your typical summer fling. Christian is swept off his feet, lured not just by physical attraction, but by the allure of a world he's never known. He sheds his boyish innocence, embracing a newfound maturity fueled by passion and desire. But this passionate entanglement comes with a heavy dose of reality. The age gap between Christian and Sana creates a constant tension. Their connection feels electric, yet fragile. Christian grapples with his newfound identity, unsure how to navigate the complexities of adult relationships. Sana, on the other hand, confronts the emotional baggage that comes with her past and the challenges of single motherhood. Boy isn't afraid to delve into the darker sides of desire. As the relationship intensifies, the initial excitement gives way to jealousy, possessiveness, and a struggle for power. The film doesn't shy away from portraying the messy reality of an illicit romance, where emotions run high and consequences loom large. The performances are truly captivating. The young actor playing Christian brings a raw vulnerability to the role, perfectly capturing the awkwardness and confusion of a young man discovering his sexuality. Sana, on the other hand, is both alluring and flawed, a woman yearning for connection but burdened by the weight of her responsibilities. The film's setting plays a crucial role. The sun-drenched Danish landscape with its long summer days becomes a backdrop for their passionate encounters, but also a reminder of the fleeting nature of summer love. Boy isn't just a story about a forbidden romance, it's a coming-of-age tale that explores themes of identity, loss of innocence, and the yearning for connection. It delves into the complexities of human relationships, questioning the lines between love, lust, and manipulation. As their summer romance reaches its inevitable climax, Christian is forced to make some tough choices. The consequences of his actions have a profound impact on his life, leaving him forever changed. Boy leaves us pondering the lasting effects of our choices and the importance of self-discovery during those pivotal young adult years. This Danish film is a must-watch for anyone who enjoys stories that challenge the status quo and explore the complexities of human relationships. It's a thought-provoking coming-of-age tale that will stay with you long after the credits roll. So, what kind of coming-of-age stories do you guys enjoy? Do you prefer light and heartwarming? or something a bit more raw and thought-provoking like boy? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Minutes for more movie insights and recommendations. We upload new content weekly so you won't miss a beat. Until next time, happy watching!